guys welcome back to my channel i hope you're all doing very good it is monday it is about quarter past nine I actually dropped sky off to daycare i've just got back because i've got a really really busy day today i feel like i've got so much to do i'm just gonna start filming now after i've done this little intro um i'm gonna film a get ready with me for youtube and a catch up because i feel like i haven't just sat down and had a good catch up in a while but yeah i've got a very busy day today so i've put baby in daycare yeah so i thought i'd film a little weekly vlog this week she tried to film a weekly vlog last week but it just kind of failed i was so busy like working from home i felt like it was so boring because i was like okay now i'm going off to film and i'm like okay i'm back from filming now i'm going to do this now i'm doing that so it just wasn't the best so yeah i scrapped that um but this week i'm in london for two days with work i've got an event with l'oreal um so yeah a bit more of a fun week how is everyone hope everyone's doing good so guys oh honestly i don't know what's wrong with me because i tried to do a five a half five morning that was you know i'm doing a 5 a.m club half five is fine for me you're still in the 5 a.m club and i just was like no and i went back to sleep till eight wow then i was like fine i'll get up at six then i was like no then i was like fine i'm gonna get up at seven and then i was still like no to be fair i had a really bad sleep last night because sky was really naughty last night she keeps getting me up in the night and like wanting to play or she's like she wants her food and she's got into this habit the last few nights and it's really frustrating me because she keeps getting me up all throughout the night um <laughs> sounds like a child <gasps> um yeah so i had like quite a bad sleep last night but honestly i've tried to do the 5am club probably about four times and recently and i'm just like no i have every intention the night before and i'm like i am doing it and my alarm goes off and i'm like no i really need to sort myself out because like i cannot i mean it's not as if i'm sleeping in every single morning but like i just can't get up super super early at the minute and i want to be getting up really early i'm just not a morning person honestly people say like on my videos how do you get up at 5 a.m so easy it is not easy for me guys okay it takes a lot honestly i'm not a morning person at all i'm so much more of a night a night owl however i did get into a really good routine i was doing it about twice a week i can't do it every day i wish i could but it just doesn't fit with my life if you're doing that every day you have to go to bed at half nine ten like you just have to i just cannot go to bed that early every night like i really can't it doesn't fit with my life or lifestyle like it just doesn't work um but i did it i was doing it about twice a week and i was feeling great so motivated honestly i was loving it um but yeah then i fell off the bandwagon and i'm finding it so hard to get back on it like it's really hard for me so yeah today was not a 5 a.m club morning at all but i'm gonna love you and leave you because i'm gonna go and film a youtube video oh so i have done my tiktok and my youtube video so i'm gonna sit and edit this now oh my gosh so i got This is such a good snack. In m and I think, I think I've seen them in like Sainsbury's and stuff as well. They have the cotton candy grapes, which is really weird because they do taste like candy. Um, but if you freeze them, oh my God. It tastes like sweets, honestly. You know, normally when people say that and it doesn't, but this actually does. It's just so cold. But yeah, I can't stop eating them. I froze a few to see what they were like. And now like the whole packet's going in there because it's so good. Um, and yeah, then I'm going to go off into town. Um, go for a nice lunch. So yeah, I'll catch up with you in a little bit. So I'm just on my way into town. I meet my friend. It's I should have put a big coat on today because it's freezing. And it's so rainy and just horrible today. But I always feel like coats just kind of ruin my outfits honestly so yeah it was so mental yesterday like the traffic lights here just weren't working 
and it's such a busy junction there's literally like cars coming from every single angle um and yeah i drove up to it and i was like the first car there and they were just blank and i was like oh my god what do i do <laughs> and then a car come next to me and we were kind of just looking at each other and i was like shit i don't know when to go because it was all of the cars like flying past but luckily the other traffic lights were all working so I kind of just judged when they were on red um, because all the cars had stopped and then I went but that was a very scary moment yesterday it made me realise how important traffic lights are um, because yeah I was like I have no idea what to do right now isn't it the worst when you're like the first one as well I'd always rather be not so I can just follow suit what everyone else does Hi my loves, I am gonna go. I'm a bit very jealous. Look who I've just got. Look how, <laughs> look how disheveled she looks. <laughs> oh my gosh, what's happened to you? It has been raining all day today. She is absolutely filthy and soaking wet. Look at them paws. Oh, I missed you today. You had a nice day. Have you had a nice day? Oh my gosh, you are so messy. She's got a groom on Thursday though, haven't you? She's gonna be all nice and fluffy when you come out. Yeah. Sky! So I've got a matcha and I'm just going to have a square of dark chocolate. I put my headband on because your girl is starting to clean. I feel like I've got a lot of stuff to do. So I'm going to time lapse some things. Um, but I'm just going to get in the zone. I'm going to put my headphones on. And I'm going to just crack on. Wow, it is a whole while later, a good three and a half hours later. The satisfaction when everything is tidied, all the candles are on, it's just the best feeling ever. Yeah, I started um, doing a bit of a time lapse and then my camera was, battery was flashing red. So then you've been on charge. Um, but I'm gonna start dinner now, it's about quarter past seven. I had quite, I'm honestly not even that hungry. Um, I had a really big lunch. We went to Wagamama's. Um, I got the, a really nice, I don't know how to say it. It begins with an R, but it's a very good curry, chicken curry. Then Bam Bam Cauliflower. And then we got a Pad Thai to share as well. We, we got so much food. So I'm not even like starving, but I'm gonna have some salmon. Um, I know I'll be hungry later. Plans for tonight, I'm just gonna chill. Um, I feel like I've had such a good productive day like even though what I did which was really good is I just started filming straight away so before I even left this morning to go and meet my friend I've done like a TikTok I'd edited three TikToks I um had filmed a YouTube video and I actually edited it I don't know how I managed to do that I just need to watch it back now before I post it tonight but yeah I'm really happy 
this is super easy and honestly it's so yummy it's a really good way just to get loads of veg in but it just tastes so good so i'm gonna start with a bell pepper actually i need to put some foil on Chop up a load of tomatoes. I'm gonna throw on salt, black pepper. Oh god, why are pepper all pepper grinders so crap? This is a garlic one. Some paprika. Tasty. I have this quite a lot. Um it's just really, really yummy. You can have it with like, honestly, everything. Oh, she can like... Dinner. I'm gonna enjoy this. Honestly, I'm so annoyed. I put my YouTube video up and it's been up for like 40 minutes and I replied to some of the comments and then I kind of let them build up a bit and then I reply and then I've just seen people say like, oh, the end cuts out. You can't even see the finished look. And I'm like, what? Because it's fine on my iMovie. Yeah, I'm like, what? Surely not. It must be like dodgy on there. Things so I've just gone onto my YouTube and it cuts off at the end and I don't know why it's done that. I'm really confused. So yeah, so all of that this morning, filming, editing, thought like, yeah, I'm going to get it up tonight. And now I've just had to delete it, which is really annoying. I'm just, I honestly have no idea. I mean, I wish I could ask you guys now so you can help me because this is a weekly vlog. So I'm going to have to figure it out tomorrow. Um, I don't know why it's done that because on my iMovie, it's literally the full video. And then I've uploaded it to YouTube and it's not the full video. So it's really weird. I don't understand. So yeah, I'm going to sit and watch and chill sit and watch and chill sit and chill and watch tv and then it's definitely gonna be snack o'clock in a little bit and a cup of tea good morning happy tuesday why do i feel like it's very blue this light wait there we go i was literally really blue then um but yeah happy tuesday tuesday morning i am back from the gym just in a hard session for like i've got spaghetti arms now after that um it is freezing today literally it's so cold but i'm gonna go and take sky for a walk this morning it's actually really nice it's really sunny it's blue skies but it's freezing um but yeah i had a good session at the gym this morning i'm gonna go and take sky and then this afternoon i've just got quite a few tiktoks to film um yeah i'm gonna go and get changed and then i'll be back this is such a beautiful park and it is a stunning day as you can see honestly like it is cold but it's so nice see so, yeah, i have really wrapped up but actually i feel like i could even take my scarf off because it's just it's so nice and i'm kind of working up a sweat the only problem is when you come to a new park i have no idea where i'm going there's loads of different like paths and stuff so I'm just gonna see where we end up. This has got a really nice little cafe in here. But like, this is my new, this is my new spot. It's very, very cute. Oh, so I'm back from walking Sky. That was a nightmare getting back. Oh my gosh, it's just taken me. And bearing in mind, it's like 15 minutes away, 20 minutes away. That's just taken me an hour to get back. The road was closed, and then there was a big diversion, and it was just chaos. Like, oh my gosh. <laughs> It was chaotic however i've just had such a nice walk really really lovely walk like the sun just honestly when it's sunny my mood goes from here to here like just with a bit of sun um i feel like that's most people isn't it but genuinely i just love i love it when it's sunny 
Um, so I'm actually gonna make lunch now. I'm gonna have a shower and wash my hair after lunch, but I'm gonna just have lunch now. I've missed breakfast. Um, I've done the gym and stuff, and then because I walked the dog, and I've ended up being out a lot longer than I thought. Um, I'm just gonna have lunch now. I'm gonna make some lettuce wraps, spicy prawn lettuce wraps. Um, I was gonna have it for dinner, but I feel like I'm gonna have it for lunch instead. And then I've got some chicken and. I don't know what I'm going to have dinner, chicken and potatoes maybe. But yeah, we're going to make that. Then we're going to go in the shower. I need to wash my hair. And then we've got some filming to do. Okay, so let's make some lunch. like wrap it up like a normal wrap mm. see as long as you make the filling super tasty they're really good just on my first meeting and oh yeah have i even vlogged today i don't think i have hi guys sorry um i was in a bit of a rush this morning got on the train in london just in my first meeting, but it's in this really cool gallery. Um, kind of for International Women's Day, they've got like really cool art. Really, really nice in here. Um, but yeah, I'm meeting my well. Why did I wear all cream today, guys? It is absolutely chucking it down. It was snowing this morning, but it's now raining. My bottom of my trousers. They're literally black, which is not good. But yeah. I'm gonna go, I've got another meeting and then I'm gonna check into my hotel in a bit and get ready for this evening. I need to get some food as well, I'm starving. But let me show you out here. So I've just checked into my hotel. Oh, this hotel is literally so cute. I've never stayed here before. I've never even heard of this hotel before. This is like one of the most gorgeous hotels ever. It's called the Mandrake. Um, it is so cute. Like literally so cute. It's got so many like different quirky things everywhere. I'm going to have to like have a little walk around and show you because it's honestly so cute but yeah basically guys the weather today is disgusting and i decided to wear full cream um it is horrible it's so cold it's freezing rain and it was actually snowing apparently here this morning um i'm kind of happy it's not snowing now because the trains always just go crazy when it snows but um yeah it's about three o'clock now my meetings are done um i need to get some lunch because i'm really hungry i was gonna like venture out but it's just so bad everywhere so i don't know whether to just get room service i'm really not sure i'm gonna see if there's like anything near um but i'm really hungry i could do with a coffee and then i'm getting picked up at 6 45 this evening for um the l'oreal dinner for international women's day which is gonna be really good i'm not sure what to expect tonight like i don't know how many people are going i don't know i literally don't know um so i'm excited to see yeah i'll get ready and everything later on um but i need some food and i need a coffee i'll show you a little room tour though it's a very cute room okay so we walk in we've got a little wardrobe thing here and then here is the room we've got another wardrobe a really nice little seating area and then this is the room itself it's very very big really big little cute little um mini bar it's very well stocked as well massive bed and then a really nice bathroom so this is when you come out of the room look how cute i mean absolutely tipping it down 
but look how pretty this is and he said there's like a rooftop up there in the summer which was must be really nice this is just literally outside of your room look you can just literally go and use this oh my god this hotel is literally so cute we're gonna have a look now on maps actually if there's anywhere I can grab some food. Oh, should I look at the room service menu first? Maybe it might be very nice. Okay, so it's not a huge menu, but still sounds really nice. There's salads, there's club sandwich. I love a club sandwich. Honestly, I love a club sandwich. Burgers, pastas. Um, oh, I really want a nice coffee. I'm gonna have a quick look on my map. Guys, it's too late. I am not going out. I've got my hotel very warm. And I'm in bed. <laughs> Do you know what? I honestly, I really fancy going for like a nice little coffee. I love being like in a calf, a nice little calf drinking a coffee. I love it. Um, but it's just horrible weather. It's absolutely pouring down. It's so cold and I just can't be bothered to like go out and walk and try and find somewhere. If it was dry, I so would. Um, but I just, I actually just really can't be bothered. So I've ordered room service um i'm gonna sit in bed i've got my book i've got my <laughs> ipad and i'm gonna chill i've got a few hours before i need to get in the shower and start getting ready and stuff so my food has just arrived i got a club sandwich because i'm actually going out for dinner tonight um we've got a dinner at l'oreal and i picked burrata for my starter that was also on the menu and there was like burgers and pasta and stuff and i didn't want like a huge because it's like half three now um maybe a bit later i didn't want like a huge huge lunch but i am really hungry at the same time see so yeah, i've gone for a club sandwich i can never turn it down when it's on the menu you know you just know it's gonna be good but i'm just very happy that i've got this coffee Hello, it's a few hours later now. I actually have had a half hour nap. It was rather nice. I was um, super chilled. Happy International Women's Day today as well. It is actually International Women's Day today. So yeah, that is um, what I'm off to do tonight for L'Oreal. It's um, for International Women's Day. I'm just getting ready now. I've got about 45 minutes. I've just got out of the shower. I was gonna wash my hair, um, but I washed it yesterday, so I really didn't want to because it's been raining and stuff today. To be fair, I did just get taxis a lot today because I had like my suitcase and it was raining so bad. And I was like, honestly, I just can't deal with it, the weather and everything. So I actually got, um, taxis and I'm going to get the tube from London um but a car come in to pick me up at 6 45 so I'm just going to start my makeup now this is a situation with the light I knew I should have bought my light I didn't have room in my case should have just forced it in because there's always really bad light in hotel rooms ah but yeah I'm gonna do my makeup now and I'll catch up with you guys in a bit I am all ready you can't even hear me in this lift <laughs> I am ready I am on my way to the event I've got a little white fur dress on thank god I had this blazer <laughs> Attracted to men. It was in a room with a bunch of men who were trying to write 
what they saw in women, you know, and the woman as an object. object. I wanted a more assertive, more contemporary, real woman, and I wanted to benefit the woman. I mean, why aren't my lips bigger? Rounder? Why aren't my cheeks more defined? Why isn't my nose a bit more like that? Or that? Why isn't my hair as sleek? Or as shiny? Or as wavy as that? Why can't I have eyes as big? As brown? As blue? Or as green as hers? Why does it seem like she doesn't ask herself any of these questions? Stop. It's so easy to look at social media. Hello guys. I am back now. It is 2 a.m. It's 1.57. Um, I'm in my PJs and I've just got into bed. I've had such a lovely evening tonight. The event was so good. Um, really nice dinner. Really, really lovely, lovely event with some amazing girls. What an amazing way to spend International Women's Day, hey? With one of my favourite brands. I feel so, so, so lucky that I was there this evening. It was honestly amazing. Um, and I met some really nice girls and yeah, a few of us went for some drinks afterwards, hence why it's now 2am. Um, but I just got into bed, I'm feeling pretty tired now to be honest. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go to sleep, I'm going to get up tomorrow, have some breakfast and then I've got a full day of meetings. I've actually got four meetings tomorrow. Yeah, four meetings, so I've got a very busy day. But yeah, I've really enjoyed this evening, it was so, so nice. Um, but I'm very excited for bed, I'm not going to lie. So I will catch up with you guys in the morning. I tried to film little bits tonight, but it was kind of hard as there was a lot of people and it was very loud, very busy, but I tried to film like a few little bits. Um, but yeah, I'll catch up with you guys in the morning. And I got a little goodie bag as well. I'll show you what I got, so. Good night. Hello guys, good morning. Hello. Honestly, I've just been sat in bed watching TikToks of that Maddie. Anyone else just obsessed with that? She makes me laugh so much. Um, I'm gonna put on a quick bit of makeup. But good morning. Last night was so much fun. And I honestly met the two loveliest girls. Um, one of them was actually staying here and then we ended up, we were like, lucky enough our um, places at the table were together. I laughed that much in ages. Um, we had such a good night and then we went for some drinks afterwards. It was so much fun. And I'm just going to go and meet her downstairs now for breakfast because um, she's staying here. And then, yeah, I've got a really busy day full of meetings, actually. Um, I've got four meetings today at 11, at 12.30, at 11, 12.30, 2 and 4. So, yeah, I've got a busy, busy day of meetings. My mum has just sent me photos. It is so snowy back at home. Like, I'm not joking, there's like this much snow off everything. Um, and it says it's now snowing in Manchester, so getting home today is gonna be interesting. Oh, Cause all the trains cancel when there's snow. Like there's no snow in London, but getting obviously back into Manchester if there's a lot of snow, is not gonna be great. It says it's snowing until one o'clock today and then it turns to rain. So hopefully, I'm really hoping that it will just be fine. Like, snow days are fun when you're like at home chilling, not when you're flipping trying to get places. Keep you updated throughout the day when I can. Obviously, I can't film when I'm in my meetings and stuff. Um, but yeah. Catch up with you guys in a little bit. up for who's the worst vlogger in the world guys i'm sorry okay i'm sorry are you gonna say hi to them
them. Oh, shall we show them your new haircut? She's had a haircut. They've gone a bit too short. Do you want to sit down? You look cute, though, still. Oh, look how cute you look. Yeah, she's got her little love heart bandana on today. Let's show them. Yeah, you're so cute. So, guys, it is now actually Saturday. <gasps> I last kept caught up with you i think it was on thursday morning i'm very sorry so i'm sure it was when i was getting ready um in my hotel room i had the busiest day in london i literally went from meeting to meeting to meeting um it was a really good day met some really great people all really positive all really good i'm really excited um but yeah it was actually impossible for me to film like i just had so many meetings um and then i got the train home and then yesterday so i was quite busy as well i had the gym in the morning um i had physio on my back i've just started getting physio on my back yeah i ended up going for dinner with my friend last night which was really nice and i was meant to vlog and then i honestly completely ended up forgetting so here we are it's now saturday i could lie to you and pretend it's just the next day but i'm not gonna do that okay so yeah it is saturday morning i missed yesterday yesterday vlogging i am sorry um but we're going to carry on. I'm just about to take Sky for a walk now. Um, honestly, I'm so confused because everywhere I feel like has had snow apart from Manchester stickers. My mum sent me photos from back at home and there is so much snow. Um, we've literally had none here. It's been so sunny. It was so sunny yesterday. It's cold, but it was really sunny. It was beautiful and kind of the same today. So... You know, I've had a nice, I look extremely puffy and tired. I have literally not long woken up, I apologise. Um, but I've literally woke up, thrown, thrown my stuff on. Um, I'm going to go and take Sky for a nice walk now. How cute is this little, um, little top as well? It's from Aloe. You know, like they do the really gorgeous yoga stuff. And so nice and cosy. So yeah, I've got this on today. I'm going to throw on my big coat. Let's go and walk. You know how I said earlier, oh, it's not snowing at all. Guys. It's snowing. Ooh. They're quite big snowflakes, actually. Oh, oh my God. Guys, the window's jammed. Oh my god. No, 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 no. <gasps> what am I actually going to do? I did not know this window was broke. I actually like don't think I've ever opened this window before. Oh. oh, the little thing at the side got jammed then. Oh my gosh, I was thinking I'm gonna freeze. I'm gonna literally turn into snowwoman. Hey right, guys, we had a beautiful, beautiful walk. It was so nice. I was out for like an hour and a half. Been to pets at home and stuff. We've got you some treats, haven't we? Yes, we have. I've just had some lunch and stuff and chilled. And then, yeah, I've got some tidying up to do. I'm going to start getting on with that. I got so many goodies in London yesterday. So, no, not yesterday, sorry, the day before. So, I'm going to show you makeup bits and stuff that I got, which is super exciting. But I'm Okay, so, um, so I'm looking a little bit more presentable now than earlier. Um, I've just done some tidying and sorting out and everything. Um, I've got so much new stuff. I thought we could do a little a little haul of like new bits, which is super exciting. Um, so when I went to London, I went um, and had quite a few meetings. Met some really great makeup brands and stuff. And yeah, I got quite a lot of goodies. But we could run through some together. Also, this came in the post. The new Refi. Bra products which I'm so excited about. This is the Brafai. This is the Refai Brow Tin. I'm obsessed. This guy's there, like turning my head. Look how nice this looks. I feel like imagine that. You can so have this as like a little coffee table book. I think this packaging is unreal. Love it. 
And then yeah, I've got all the shades. There's a soft brown, medium brown, deep brown, black. I will probably be like a deep brown or medium brown. Super excited to try this. I am obsessed with Refi. I, every day without fail in my makeup, whenever I do my makeup, I'll use at least one Refi product. It's such a great brand. So I'm super, super excited to try this out. So we've got Pixie stuff. Now I, if you've watched my videos, you know that I use every morning without fail, like the Pixie um, cleansing gel. Love it. I've used it for years. Pixie skincare is great. However, I didn't know how good Pixie makeup was. I've always kind of known it more for skincare. And I feel like a lot of people do. Um, but their makeup is insane. So I went to um, a masterclass of theirs last year sometime. Um, and one of the main makeup artists, Pixie, she's amazing. She's called Amanda. She did a masterclass. She's super talented and i was like oh my gosh so i went and ordered a load of stuff because i was so impressed with their makeup this is my favorite one of my favorite products of theirs the flawless beauty primer now i use this all the time i'm so buzzing that they've given me a top up because i've nearly run out this is absolutely stunning before makeup gives you the most gorgeous glowy skin so obsessed with this and I was speaking to the lovely lady Amanda in there and she told me to get the vitamin C cream as well because she said these two together and she showed me on the back of her hand and I'm so excited to try. I've got the H2O Skin Tint Face Gel which is like a foundation i think it is a foundation i also got these look incredible she was showing me on the back of her hands you can hardly feel it going on these eye pencils because they just glide so well and they smudge out really nicely as well if you want like that smoky look so i got them in black cocoa bronze beam this bronze one looks absolutely stunning um and also sage gold i also got oh my gosh this liquid fairy lights glittery eyeshadow in the shade rose gold which looks incredible i really like the applicator as well it's um if you can see oh it's super pretty wait let me bring you in because the light's not very good can you see that it's so pretty so you can use it like this on your eyes and then you can rub it out if you want it like more sheer but this is ah uh, look how beautiful that is then got oh a glow oil i've got this in like the lavender flavor and it's gorgeous this is the mint flavor i just love honestly throughout the days i don't wear like lip liner lipstick unless i'm going like out out i just prefer prefer to wear um just like a gloss or an oil so that's fab i also got this sheer rose lip gloss this is stunning make sure you're following me on um tiktok as well because i always do little makeup tutorials and stuff on there daily so yeah fabulous love all this stuff oh my gosh and i've also got a glow tonic with my name on it how cute then moving on to one of my other favorite brands kylie cosmetics how exciting so i i feel very lucky guys so i got some amazing makeup from there as well this is the more palette which as soon as i saw it i was like wow so i actually had a lunch with them and yeah i got some amazing guys literally look at this palette like these shimmer shades i actually cannot deal early glosses i love i have got a few and i've used them all at the time so i got them in the shades clear diva not your bay and oh natural oh these are beautiful Ooh, this one looks super pretty it's got like a bit of shimmer in it and also oh, i'm buzzing about this i got the lip oil my mom is obsessed with this i get one every christmas and she just loves it it's coconut it smells so good so nourishing on your lips like this is 
honest to gosh, unreal. And then I got two blushes. Now I've got Kylie blusher and it's amazing. I love it. This one is Winter Kiss. And then, do you know what? I just think the packaging for Kylie Cosmetics is insane. And do you know what I love? All of these little compacts have a mirror, which is so handy. The amount of little compacts that don't. And then this one is Pink Power. They both look gorgeous. Oh, I'm very excited to try them. And this is a bronzing powder. I don't think I've actually ever used a Kylie bronzer. This is in the shade Khaki. So, oh, I cannot tell you how excited I am to use them. Literally, thank you so much. I am beyond excited. And then I got some stuff from Rimmel London. Get the London look. Very excited. I've actually not tried any of these concealers, which is really exciting. Um, so the Multitasker Concealer. So I got one in nude, and then I've also got a darker shade to contour as well. So this will be amazing to try for cream contour. Love the applicators as well. Very similar to Tarte Shape Tape, and I love the applicators. You can go straight in. So easy to use. So I'm very excited to try them. And I have got the Rimmel London Stay Matte. I have tried this before. Really good powder. Um, and then this is apparently one of their really um, popular mascaras, which is exciting because I've not used... I have used Rimmel mascaras in the past, and I always really like them. Um, but I haven't used this one. This is a Thrill Seeker Extreme Black, so... I'll let you know how I get on with that. And then I also have got some bits from Armani Beauty, which is beyond exciting. So I actually went to the counter and I got my makeup done. The woman was so lovely. And I love the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk. That's one of my favourite foundations. Such a gorgeous foundation. Um, but other than that, I hadn't used like a ton of their products. So it was really exciting to sit down with them. And she taught me through a load of their products. She's actually sending out everything that she used on me. So when that comes, I'll be able to show you guys. Um, because there was some stunning stuff. Like, honestly, so nice. But I have got two perfumes. They're so nice. Let's smell this one. I was actually trying out loads of the perfumes as well. She was showing me all the new ones and... Oh my gosh, they were incredible. I love this bottle as well. Oh, oh, that is very nice. That smells good. I love perfume so much. And oh, you get so much in that. That's really good. That's massive. It powers. So it's a long wear lipstick. Honestly, the, all the Armani... Um, packaging i think it's so sleek and pretty oh they're so nice they're actually quite glossy which is really nice because i'm such like a gloss girl i really don't like really matte lips um i love the look of matte lips but i just hate the feel so that's why i'm always putting gloss on but these lipsticks if you can see i'm sorry i've put that in the most awkward place but there is a really nice shine to it so it's not matte at all and it just glided on it feels super super hydrating and smooth which is really nice because i feel like you'd definitely be able to wear that without a gloss it's not going to be like super dry you know it goes like all wrinkly and horrible on the lips so really excited to try them out as well oh my gosh i can't believe how much insane stuff i've got literally it's all come up once so i'm just feeling super super grateful this has arrived today as well it's a new brand called raise and replenish um matcha stuff like it's all like plant-based lattes but they've got um loads of different ones also i just feel like this packaging is insane so no one is me and that is my power and a whole latte goodness just for you i honestly love this packaging so much they're all plant-based lattes um full of like nutrients and stuff so i got this one plug me in i'm pretty sure this is matcha yeah so matcha green tea lemon balm lion's mane ginseng and then i also got this one because it looked so gorgeous because it's pink um it's like a pink latte this one's beetroot mtc oil lemon juice powder and don't know how to say that hi welcome to starbucks what can i get you for you today 
Hiya, can I get an oat milk flat white, please? An oat milk flat white, yeah, of course, and now. And then a puppuccino. And a puppuccino, is that all for you? Yes, please, thank you. Thank you very much, I'll see you at the next one. Thanks. For Sunday, having a Sunday morning treat. She honestly loves puppuccinos so much. It is so cute. This pot's out. Come on, got a Starbucks. Happy Sunday. It's a beautiful day. I am just going to go back now. I am going to start editing this video because I really want this to go up tonight. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see if it does. Um, I have got a little Pilates event today where I normally go for Pilates. Um, she's putting on... The lovely ladies putting on an event with look fantastic which is actually really exciting um so yeah go in there at 12 45 and then i think we're gonna go um for a sunday dinner later um so i'm gonna film probably up to the um the event and then i will call it a week um i've had a lovely week this week it's been super super nice I um, feel so grateful and excited for lots of things. Um, so yeah, I had a really fab week. And I really love Sundays as well. I feel like Sunday is one of my favorite days. Thank you. 